non-traditional for game day location and uh, this Auburn Kentucky matchup. Well, I think it's great. I, I've, this is my first time actually at Auburn, but I've watched so many games, and as a former player who was passionate and liked whether the crowd was booing me or cheering for me, the atmosphere is electric here. So I can't wait to take not only a game day tomorrow, but to take in the game as well. What do you see from this Auburn basketball team, maybe as compared to to last year, had a little different style? Yeah, they're, they're, it's not last year's team. Uh, Harper and Brown could flat out shoot it, and they could create a lot of turnovers and get some easy baskets in transition. That's not this group this year. This group is talented. It's just not the same as last year's group. Uh, for me, uh, the two backcourt, the guards, McCormick, uh, that's just some weird dowdy. Those guys have to shoot the basketball really well tomorrow. Uh, in the last two losses, they're combined 8 of 38 from the field, and that won't get it done against Kentucky, whose uh, trio of guards that they have out there on the floor with Maxi, uh, they can, Ashton Hagens, those guys can really defend and they'll be up and in, so they're going to make it difficult for Auburn to be able to drive the basketball. So they're going to have to reverse it, I'd say, two or three times, and then look to attack on the weak side of the floor. And they've got to figure out how to get the basketball to the rack and get some easy points. What have you seen uh, in your study of Acoro? Yeah, he, so, some some guys when they're out there they just make the game look easy, <laughs> and he's one of those guys. I mean, his ability to be able to start, stop, uh, change speeds, change direction is really impressive. Especially as you consider the fact that he's a freshman. Uh, obviously, he's got a, a more mature body, and uh, watching him closely, he seems to me to not take any plays off on the defensive end. That's really impressive for a freshman. Thank you.